You're right, Rex. She's dead. Shit, man, I told you. Looks like she went to go have a shower. She slipped. She's too wasted to be having a shower. I want to be the one to tell Reese that his girlfriend died naked in our flat. It's not the way it is. That's not it. You'll see it. I knew she was on tabs at the party. And she suddenly decides to come around here for a shower. What do you think? Cover her up. Cover it up. Take her a little away from here. Okay, okay. Maybe I did see someone last night. Maybe some people. How many? Two. <laughs> blonde hair, too, yeah. Bleach blonde, not I, Beetha blonde. And short. Both of them short. Their hair, you mean? <laughs> yeah, what do you think I meant? The legs. Funny man, aren't you? Did you fancy them, James? What? Did you fancy them? It's a simple question, really, isn't it? I don't get what you're asking. I mean, when I look at a girl, the first thing I think isn't. Do I fancy him? You're a guy, right? You see a fit bird, wanted to notice you, wanted to give you the eye. <laughs> I mean, they were both good. Uh, both of them good, like twins. Make your proposal, did they? Maybe. Really? <laughs> not just often. They don't. I see it. Out in the street having a fight. He tries to rip her, he gets out of her hand and then he smashes her brains out! Whoa, Rex, Rex, why are you wet? The shower was running when I went in. Oh, but you're soaking. And why do you keep going on about her being raped? No reason. Yeah, but you seem pretty certain. And the door wasn't broken into. No, she left it open. Yeah, and you kept saying she was giving you the eye last night. Maybe you thought she was that drunk she won't even remember. You know what women are like. Always trying to hit me. Oh no, this was different. This was different, wasn't it? She fought back. Yeah. And that's when she fell. Go on, Kurt, you've got to help me out on this one. I love you big time. She's very, very clean, if you know what I mean. And all you've got to do is dress her and then, and then take her somewhere. And, and, and then we'll never speak about it again. Something special, really, James, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I know it. I know it. I mean, most guys, the night after, be so much meat under the bridge, wouldn't it? But you? Oh no! You're a man of your honour, aren't you? Yeah? Um, yeah, I mean, I find. I think. Do you know what I think? I think you're in your cell, sitting there, playing with yourself, wondering if they're gonna deliver or not. But do you know what? I think we both know that you have their number tattooed on your tiny little brain. <laughs> <laughs>